Hey, what's up, truckers? How are you doing, guys? I hope you are doing absolutely great. So, in this video, guys, I'm gonna telling you eight to eight about trucker SMP, uh, regarding the job dispatcher, regarding all of the most of the basic rules and stuff, and uh, what do you find a lot of players. So, without further wasting any time, let's jump into the video. Let's go. So, for that reason, guys, just open up your favorite browser. Uh, and then search for Rocker MP. And what you have to do, let me log out. First of all, you have to register over here, okay? It's this one, the register. Click on register. And then you have to sign in with the Steam. As per, I already signed in with the Steam. So I will unable to register again. All right. Remember, one Steam ID is equal to one Trucker MP ID. You can't do multiple Trucker MP ID using one Steam ID. All right. So click on login, my trace, and all the stuff. There you go. So it's basically my ID, and uh, you have to download this one. The get the mod. Just click download now, and you will be getting a raw file of Rocker MP and uh, in that case remember one thing if you have uh, ETS2 main version I mean the original version from Steam then only you can play Trucker MP rather than that you will be unable to play Trucker MP sir all right so make sure you have the original version from Steam all right and the second criteria is you have to play at least 2.5 hours to play trucker sim otherwise you will be not eligible to play trucker sim my dear so make sure you have completed both of the criteria. first one is you have to purchase the game from steam and second one is uh at least you played 2.5 hours okay the base game i'm selling so i believe it's downloaded and uh, you can install it because i already has been installed trucker sim so i'll be unable to install uh, and you guys are smart enough to do those things by your single handed. You guys are pretty much smart enough more than me. All right, so open up the trucker's MP and uh, second in second, like uh, go to the settings and make sure you give the ETS2 and ETS path correctly. All right, then click on save, then go to the play and just click on play. All right, so over here. You have to give your password and the email ID which you have registered in the website. All right. So just click on remember me. And if you want to do, you can also hide your email for the security reasons. Then just click on login. And those are the servers basically. Like uh, as per you can see, this is simulation one on the most popular server in Trucker CMP. And the simulation two. It's also a bit popular. It's the US simulations. It's the ACP Singapore server. It's Arcade server. Arcade server means basically it's a non collision server. The whole server is non collision and there is no speed limit. All right. It's a ProMod server. ProMod, I believe you know ProMod. If you don't know ProMod, I made a video regarding A to Z about ProMod. You can check it out. That video, I'm going to post that link on the description box and as well as on the i button. All right. It's also a promote arcade. It's a VTC convoy stuff. Like you can see, as per right now, it's a Aurora VTC convoy going on. I believe it has been ended. I believe. I don't know. There are 31 players uh, uh, still over there. I don't know. So, in that case, uh, let's jump into the simulation one and join the server. So, this is the profile. Uh, you can change your profile or it's up to you. Like, if you want to play with this profile, you can. Or if you want to change your profile, you can do it. No worries. Let's continue game. All right. So this is the map basically. The same thing. Uh, the ACS version of the Trucker MP version. There is uh, no difference in the ACS version. You will get bots and all the stuff. And in the Trucker MP version, you will don't get any kind of bots. So first thing first, guys. I'm gonna telling you some two or three basic rules. Eventually, I'm not a master in game. Uh, don't make me wrong, guys. I'm just a regular guy who used to play Trucker MP from past four years. All right. So in my opinion, first of all, guys, please obey the traffic rules. Second on, please obey those signals. All right. If you are in a crowded place, 
obey the signals guys all right don't dodge any kind of red signals and if the signal shows yellow please go slow otherwise guys you will get banned and third of all guys it's the main tip if you feels like that you're gonna crash into someone please press alt f4 trust me you will not get banned 100 percent sure if you feels like you're gonna crash into someone just press alt f4 all right it's gonna save you from one week long man or maybe more than that all right guys you're gonna thank me later if you do it <laughs> but yeah it's a plan b and use the alt f4 in a uh, whatever you feels like yeah now my game is you know not in my control <laughs> then only use that otherwise rather than that you can control your truck all right just press brake and all the stuff you know guys you got it smarter all right then uh, let's go to drive all right guys now you are entered on truckers mp now it might be thinking where are the players why i'm not getting crowded players why i'm not getting any players to play with me no worries guys just relax and come to Kalais. Welcome to Kalais. This is the most crowded area. You will see every time players coming. Uh, yeah, look at this. Look at this piece of shit. <laughs> so this is the most crowded place of ETS2, guys. So make sure if you, I'm recommending if you have a medium PC or if you have a, uh, a decent PC. Then come to Kalais. Rather than that, just spawn outside the Kalais. Like, uh, go to Lili. Uh, you can go to um, Dover. You can go other places. But don't come to Kalais because this is the most shittiest place ever. <laughs> oh my gosh. And uh, second of all, guys. So, this is the CD route. Like, uh, you can go from Kalais to Duisburg like this or you can go to Dortmund all right so this is the most this is the most crowded place of whole trucker simply the cd route you will get ton of players 24 into 7 on this route okay this is the most busiest route most stupidest route and most laggiest route all right guys so be careful when you are driving in this route because you will get banned if you do any kind of stupidity or any kind of reckless driving. Alright guys. So now you must be thinking now I'm in Kalais. Now how supposed to be I take job. So this is the most and the easiest thing which TMP have ever met. Just press your tab. Okay. So what is this? This is basically the players. They are new, which are they nearby to you. Like I can see as per players near to you, 125. That's mean 125 players are nearby to me. Alright. Now, second thing, second. This is the job dispatcher. You just have to click right click to, you know, free your console, free your mouse, I mean to say. Just click on, just click right click and your mouse will be free. Then click on the second option called job dispatcher. Just click on it. Now this is the thing. Like this is the place where you are in right at this moment. Second of all, where do you want to go? Like in my case, I want to go to Dortmund. Just click on Dortmund. Right? Now this is the company which you want to choose. Like which company you want to go. Uh, let's take a job towards to ITCC. Right? And this is the cargo, like which uh, cargo you want to pick up. Like if you have cargo DLCs like JCB, like uh, heavy transport, like high value transport, you will get everything over here. You can just search it over here like uh, a locomotive. You'll get locomotive over here. So this is the cargo section and this is the trailer section. If you think... That I know I'm not like liking this trailer like this. I'm not liking this trailer. I'm not changing my trailer. You can change to flatbed. If you are not still liking the trailer, you can change to Crony Box Liner. So it's completely up to you, might. All right. But if you have your own trailer, just click on Use Current Own Trailer. All right. Just click on it, 
and then those are the cargo which you can take because as per you can see i have the refrigerator so those are the all cargos which can be delivered by the refrigerator like you can take any of this like in my case let's take uh ice cream it's some over here so yeah so, and then click on this take the job immediately all right then generate job offer that's it so you can see there is a parking box yep so you have to park over here i mean basically if you have taking a trailer if you have your own trailer you have to park your trailer to take the job if you don't have your trailer you will get trailer like this which has been standby like this guy uh he doesn't have trailer so he basically took a random job and this is his trailer it's a van job so this is the thing it's pretty simple guys you get used to it after doing one or two times it's pretty much simple and third thing basically this is a system there's a general system like uh, you can change your tag like as per i'm in a vtc next logistics vtc if you guys want to join you can you guys are always welcome so yeah this is the vtc tag um this is job sharing privacy like it's up to you like uh, if you do public anybody can share your jobs if you do steam friend if then only steam friend can share your job and if you do private nobody can't share your job all right this is a player follow privacy you can do it by yourself like if you want that uh, your friends could follow you i mean by pressing the sas follow command then the, you can do it like steam friend only and if you don't know that anyone want to follow you then you can just click on private all right this is cb radio channel like uh, default cb radio is 19. cb radio means uh, in that uh, channel the trackers are usually uh, communicate to each other all right but uh, longing by you can also communicate to other trackers by pressing x x button on your keyboard all right so yeah basically those are the settings and the sound you can you know put your microphone over here and uh, put your earphones or headphones over here all right and then go to game and these are the normal game settings you can do it by yourself the graphic settings okay as uh, the interface you can copy my settings as well as but if you want to explore more you can do it by yourself no worries man just click on apply and click on okay that's it so guys yeah those are the most uh, basic things uh, if you have uh, any problem regarding trucker mp or any problem regarding anything in regarding ets2 or trucker mp you can just DM me on my discord or you can just ask me when i used to stream because i used to stream every day like from 4 30 p.m ist to 10 30 p.m ist see you there thank you very much for watching the video guys i hope you guys like this video and if you guys like the video you know the drill you have to like the video and if you're new to the channel guys what you have to do just smash subscribe button with your favorite scania truck <laughs> all right guys it's me nemesis signing off thank you bye bye and happy trucking bye guys bye